What's up with it, y'all? It's your girl Felicia back again with another video. And today, I'm just going to let y'all watch me slay this hair store wig. <laughs> I know a lot of times um, I'll just buy a wig because I don't want to wait on one in the mail and I need this hair done immediately. So I went ahead and bought a hair store wig. And every time I do this, I regret it. But I bought another hair store wig. So I'm going to show you what you can do with a hair store wig when you get one. You know, a lot of these wigs, they say it's virgin. They say this. But you can tell by touching the hair that it is nothing like ordering a real wig from a reputable company. So when you get a wig like this, have fun with it. Play around with it. And that's exactly what I did. I'm going to throw some colors. I got Royal Navy and African Violet from Adore. I also had some soft lavender left over so i'm pretty much just gonna play around uh this is not a tutorial because i don't know what i did i done just created some stuff so i'm gonna let y'all watch a little bit i'll jump in here and there and for all you guys that follow me on my bbl journey if you make it to the end of this video you'll see what doctor i'm going to so stay tuned oh yeah if you want to try to do something like this i will put everything i used in the description box so you can try it for yourself i'll even include like a little 613 wig down there just in case you want to practice nothing too expensive so check the description box if you want to give this a try I didn't show much of the coloring process, but dog, I had to rinse, 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 rinse. That blue was just not coming out. It was ridiculous. I got so tired of rinsing this hair. But anyway, this is what it came out looking like. It came out pretty cute, y'all. You know, went from kind of like a little soft pink to a purple to a blue. And yes, I liked it. The top is silver. I didn't tone the hair. What I did was when I was doing the purple dip dye, I let the hair soak up most of the purple. And when there was just a little bit left in the bucket, a little tint left, I went ahead and dipped the whole wig in there to tone it. So yeah, it turned out right to me. If you want to see a coloring video or see how I dip dye, be sure to comment below and I'll let you see that. This is just showing you how the sides kind of blended on in there. You know, your girl had it going on. I was kind of proud of this color. It came out really nice for me just playing around. Yeah, so it's cute. Like I said, if you want to see videos on how I color these wigs, comment below. So yeah, this is how it came out after I went ahead and straightened it. I kind of styled it a little bit. I never wear the styles where they have like the little ponytail in the top and I think that's really cute. So I went ahead and did that. I was kind of trying to decide, do I want to leave it straight? Do I want to put some curls in it? And I was also trying to feel the texture of the hair because when I got the wig, it felt kind of rough, but they didn't have many um, 613 wigs available at that store that had the ear to ear front on the front so I went ahead and got it so after I did all the washing and conditioning and blow drying with the um, serums and all that it came out pretty good it felt pretty good I still wasn't satisfied so I decided let me go ahead and throw some curls up in here okay little blueberry creation come through okay no nah, but the wig was cute on the mannequin head y'all but when i put that wig on honey you need to wear makeup lashes all that i look so damn washed out watch good morning what's up with it y'all i haven't seen y'all in a while i act like i really be seeing y'all through the stream but you know what i mean i just got on here to tell y'all that your girl has finally chose a doctor okay chain gang 
So yeah, that's gonna conclude this video. And moral of the story, when you buy a raggedy ass wig from the hair store, make blueberries. <laughs> Nah, I'm just playing. You know, I got that from, you know, life throw you lemons, make lemonades. I was trying it. Never mind. Anyway, if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe. Stay tuned because I got another journey coming up in Miami in May. Okay. So go ahead and hit that bell so you can get notifications when I post so you don't miss nothing. I love you guys. Shout out to Black Diamond 24. Um, I'm going to give you a better shout out in my next video. But thank you for all your support. Thank y'all for commenting. I love y'all. Talk to you later. Bye.